Right, today we are at a typical mid-terrace property in Treybridge and Wiltshire. We've done some previous works here. Um, this was basically to resolve penetrating damp issues. So here you can see you've got rust and rainwater goods. You've got a lot of masonry paint that's cracked. There's a timber lintel here and poorly installed window. And there's lots of, again, bubbling, blistered paint, trapping in lots of moisture at high level and low level, to be fair. So you can see we've got a new lime render and lime wash. The customer lime washed it, done a very good job. And then we removed all the modern masonry paint on the back here and um, repointed it with a lime putty. And again, the customer lime pointed it. We fixed a couple of guttering issues, but there's been a lot of damp inside as well, at high level and low level. So the initial scope was resolve the outside stuff and then come back when it started drying down and have a look at the inside stuff. So part of the inside scope as well is to check the drains. And this is just a classic example here. So what you can actually see is now we've actually got, so that is the kitchen sink just where and you can just see just down here, there's your soil pipe there. You can see there's a little crack down in there. Uh, you've got a lot of wet tissue in that round there, so you know it's been like sort of like backing up and you've got a lot of um, mortar bricks about to fall off, so that can actually block the drain as well. I don't know if you can see it, but you can see there's just a big chunk just missing down. Just get a finger in. There. But also, you can see we're literally the camera head is literally just in there. I just want to show you this as well. So you can actually see you've got a displaced joint there. We've left the tap running so you can actually highlight the actual water that's running down the edge there. So that basically washes out all the soil around there. And um, there is a bit of crack in there. It looks like there's been a repair there as well previously. Whether that's part of it, I don't know. But the chap that lives here has lived here for a very long time. He doesn't know anything about it. So yeah, you can see all these little things here are a great cause of rising damp internally. And just by doing some a system inside, whether it's modern or traditional, it's probably not going to resolve it. Now, if you've had long-term issues with the drains like that, what you can do is you can wash out the ground around it and you cause subsidence issues and stuff. So you've got to be very careful about this. So we're going to get all this resolved and um, let's get this moving forward for them. Thanks for watching.